What's up, you guys? It's me, Tad and the Toy Guy. And this will be a Backing with J Mike 9 2 video. Featuring my Easy Back Oven I had for three years. Got it, I bought it around Christmas 2013. And this is what I'm baking today. This is the Pe Betty Crocker Peanut Butter Cookie Mix. I bought this at, got this at Walmart for like a dollar. And this is the, already the cookie dough that I'm about to put in the pan. It's four tablespoons of cookie dough and three one-fourth teaspoons of water. And this is the consistency I was going for with the cookie dough. And here's the pan, one of the pans I get. And I'm going to spray it with um butter spray. Okay, so this is, so that was enough um cookie dough to make, put six cookies on the pan, which is what I was going for. And I'm just going to continue waiting until the oven get, gets hot to put them in there. And I did use a fork to give them like the illusion of real peanut butter cookies like the ones on the package. And this is something, this, this is great for people who can't afford a real easy bake mix. It's, I can afford them, but I just choose not to buy them because they're not that great tasting. And the real cookie dough and cake mixes and all that tastes way better. So, there's that. Okay, now I'm going to slide them in the Easy Bake Oven. And I'm just going to check to see if the other door closed too. Yep, it is. Now I'm going to set the timer for like 10 minutes. 10 to 12 minutes. It all depends on what time I choose. Okay, while well, the first batch is cooking, I did make some more dough. And I um, made it the same way I explained earlier. Cause I made it like this because I don't want the dough to be runny. Well, it's thick, but not runny yet. And you can just mold it and put it in the cookie pan. This is another one of the pans I got. I have got like two, three pack of pans when I bought this one. And I bought this off the Hasbro website. Now, at that time, I gave the other pans to my little cousins, because at that time, they both had easy bake ovens. But they don't have those anymore, but I still got mine. And I, I'm trying to like make pop tarts in this, but I know it's a way I can. But I'm not gonna do it today. I'm just gonna be focusing on the you know butter cookies right now, cause the ingredients to make pop tarts can cost. But I'm gonna see when I can get those. But other than that, I'll be making getting peanut butter cookies. Okay, so the first batch just um I just took the first batch out the main part. And, now I'm gonna let them sit in the cooling chain for about five minutes. And after that, I'll put the second batch on there. That's all I'm baking is just two batches because I just want to show you how to bake them. Um, cookie mix, dry cookie mix in the Easy Bake Oven. And, it's, and it, it bakes just like everything else in the Easy Bake Oven. I, only, I don't buy the refills because I find the um, stuff in a baking guide that tastes pretty better. Like the, Dry cake and cookie and brown mix for the bacon guy to taste way better, but they were way cheaper too. Six dollars can get us like uh, some cake, dry cake mix, some frosting, and a pack of cookie dough, and probably a little more too, depending on how much it is. But yeah, this is just a disclaimer that. You don't have to spend um, a lot of money on the easy bake refills because you can bake stuff and using your own homemade recipes or the cookie and cake mix and all that from the baking gal in Walmart. So that's what I've been doing most of the time. Oh yeah, frozen cookie, refrigerated frozen cookie don't work too because I tried that before. Like maybe three years ago and it still worked just as great. But yeah, this is it. 
now I'm going to bake the second half and I'll show you all what they look like afterwards. Okay, now the other batch is done. I will be eating these with milk. I'm hoping we all 12 right now, but if not, I'll eat the rest later. But yeah, this is it. it I, had baked, I had baked just enough for 12 cookies. And yeah, that's it. I could have added some Reese's Pieces in them, but I didn't buy any. I didn't think getting them when I was in the store yesterday. But I will be eating these plain, but they're good either way. But yeah, like this video, great comment, and also subscribe to my YouTube channel. And as always, thanks for watching.